Morning. Good morning, everybody. Happy Monday. First of March. First of March, new month, Fifth. new week. Hopefully new looking forward. <laughs> <laughs> it's weird to think, isn't it? March is a bit of a... Because it's obviously nearly come up to a year, isn't it, since I lockdown? I know. Is that crazy. Gosh, it is, isn't it? New year. Yeah, wow. it's crazy. A whole um, year being locked inside, yeah. in some cases. <laughs> well, yeah, a whole year of being locked inside. Um, but this morning we are looking at our side-by-side -side, um, strollers and pushchairs. And we do get requested quite a lot um, to look at those side-by-side -side strollers. Mm -hmm, absolutely. Um, whether it's for twins, whether you've got two children at d different ages, yep. um, it kind of will it will work for both, won't mm -hmm. it? Which Absolutely. is great. You can adapt things with carry cots, uh, just yeah. seats, car seats. You have that ability. Seats really both nice. on birth, a lot of different mm -hmm. features, isn't there? Oh, we've got lots of good mornings. Um, I'm getting used to seeing a lot of the most same, similar same names. names over and over again. Um, so Marie Maria Leddington um, was our fastest morning. finger this morning. So good morning. We've got Jane. We've got Claire. We've got Jody and Stacy and Mike. Everyone's tuned in on a Monday morning. And Emma, good morning, everybody. Oh, um, we're excited for summer. Oh, good. Jolena yes, we are said. Too. Good Love a bit of sunshine. We do. We need a bit of sunshine. Mm -hmm. Oh, Gemma's put. I was only talking to my partner last night about I need a pregnancy pill. I really struggling to get comfy at night. Now my bump is getting big, bigger. Well, there oh. you go. You have announced our prize already. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> um, so this morning we are giving away. Um, a um, BB Hug Me pregnancy and nursing pillow. Um, so yeah, really, really nice. Obviously can be multi-use. Great to have That's during it. pregnancy, mm -hmm. as, that, as I say, as bump grows and you need that extra support. Then use it um, as nursing afterwards, which is really nice. Really maybe a little bit of um, a baby support as well when they're sort of starting to sit up. They yeah. have that little support at the very, very back. Yeah, and it's a really nice one. Mm -hmm. um, prize worth up to £130. Can't beat that. No, so it is really, really good. Um, and so will last you all the way through, mm -hmm. which is lovely. Um, oh, we've got some people spotting um, some push chairs. Loving the Bugby Donkey and the um, Baby Joggers. Absolutely, yeah. Show some love. But yeah, really... I'm about to as well, but I'm sort of hiding it. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But, um, yeah, so all you need to do is join in with the like, chit-chat this morning. Every comment that is made um, will be in the draw to win the nursing pillow. Um, so, yeah. Very we'll announce at the end. If you are new here, what we do is we kind of wait till the end of the live and we will announce it live mm -hmm. um, on here. So you'll know by the end of the video. Absolutely, absolutely. But, yeah, um, what we'll do is we'll run through the, go through the strollers. Mm -hmm. um, but I will kind of leave this around the front just so you can have a look but yeah really great prize um this morning uh see what some people are saying oh look at the love in the prize in um all keely said hope you had a wonderful weekend oh, we did nice. thank you um we were, well i was working you had saturday off didn't you but then it was on sunday yeah didn't do anything though couldn't actually go out anywhere <laughs> that's the thing isn't it <laughs> Cleaning and getting on with whatever jobs you can do around that's the house, it, really. It. It's painting, decorating. Yeah, people are loving um, what we've got. Um, Claire said, I've just had my glucose intolerance test, not feeling the best. Winning today would make me feel better. Oh, fingers Aww. crossed, Claire. Well, you've commented, so you're in the draw to win, which you is are. really handy. You are. Um, Lisa said she still loves her pregnancy pill and she's not pregnant anymore. There you sometimes go. it's just a nice little comfy pillow to have around the house if needed to oh, be, yeah. or, you know, something to cuddle up to. Yeah. There's like thousands of As uses. Laura gave a little hack away the other week, she said she used her nursing pillow. She said, she said just let you know, Georgia, like to give you a bit of information. Yeah. After giving birth, you're a bit, you're a bit sore, so oh, you I have heard. to like sit down. She sat on her nursing pillow. Oh, there you go. So there's, there you, it's multi-use, you see, multi-use. Yeah, for your bottom, to your back, <laughs> to your everything. So yeah, everything, perfect. yeah. Um, but yeah, people are really loving the fact that you have we're looking at doubles today. We did have lots of requests, didn't we? We did, yes. At doubles. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, because it kind of, whether you're having second child now, mm -hmm. or you've got looking that at twins if needed. You've yeah, got you've got that crossover. Options. Where should we start? I know, there's quite a few. Should I do donkey as it's near me? Start yeah, first. so you can start with the Bugaboo donkey. And mm -hmm. um, we've got it here on the aluminium frame um, and in the grey melange colour. And we have got it set up as duo. That's it, we've got a nice duo mode. So you can have it obviously in a mono, which is single. Duo is one older child and one younger, or you can actually get it in a twin as well, which is really, really nice. Yeah. So I'm just going to show you the donkey as a okay. single, just so you can sort of see how she changes and adapts, because she's sort of like the only double here that yeah. you can then have as a single push chair. It's very clever, our to, donkey. Which is really, really nice. So 
So, now you will get a basket with the push chair. It's just ours is being used at the moment, but you do get a basket, and that can take 10 kilograms of weight, which is was pretty decent weight yeah, for the basket it's decent weight, itself. Yeah. So, turning it into a single, you open your flap at the front. There's a little flap at the very, very back. Flap on the handle. You're opening three flaps on one push chair. Oh, Zara's being weighted to be induced this morning with twins. Oh, there you go, see? Oh, maybe. <laughs> Squeeze the button in and then the whole frame is going to come into itself. So the nice thing is obviously if you are looking at one older, one younger push chair for a child itself, when the older child no longer needs the push chair, yeah. you can easily convert it into a single push chair. It smallens down and then you're ready to take on the world. I like this way maybe chair. you've got children at two different ages because obviously then the you know for a fact that the children won't need to be in that push at the same time. Absolutely. But yes. also if you're having twins, because mm -hmm. no two twins develop the same way nope. and will walk the same time. Um, so you may have one that walks a bit, um, a bit more mm -hmm. and a bit more steady on their feet. So you can always squish it down to that single mode when you don't need it. Absolutely. My cousin um, had one of these, which she took to San Diego. Um, and mm. everyone loved it out there because it's not very uh, obscene in that area. No. So they were like, oh, what does it do? What does it do? You know? Yeah, fascinated by it. Absolutely. I was worried I was going to punch myself in the face. <laughs> that would have been a fun entertainment for everybody. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm just going to put it back to double mode itself. And you just literally do the reverse to get her back out again. So nice and easy. So quick. You can nice literally get it up and down. It's great if you are looking at the donkey. Obviously, if you fold it in double mode, it's going to be a bigger fold. Mm -hmm, but absolutely. because of how quick it is to take it down to a single, you can, obviously, when you get to the car, take the seats off, That's squish it. it down to single, and then fold it. Mm -hmm. So pop in your carry cot on the frame itself. So carry cot will always naturally face you. But if you had an older child, say maybe they wanted to go to the park or the zoo and see out, the seats are completely independent. Yeah. So you can have one facing out and the carry cot facing in, or both facing inwards, Yeah. both facing out. It's completely your choice, which is really, really nice. And it's not a heavy push chair. No, it feels nice and light. I like the fact that you can have the seats in different positions. So obviously when you do have the seat mode, mm -hmm. um, so you've got two on there, you can have one in like the position of world facing and one parent facing so that they can see each other. Yeah. You can also have them both re uh, parent, I say rear facing, I said this yesterday, <laughs> like, I've got car seats in my hand. Um, you can have them both world facing or you can have them both parent facing. So whatever adapts and whatever works for your, your family and lifestyle, which is, which is great. Does it like we need it to? Which is it does come in three different options. So, um, you can have the Bugaboo Donkey in mono, duo, and twin. Mm -hmm. Now, that will all depend on obviously what you need it as. Um, yeah. Mono is just for one. So, for one child, you can still use your donkey. Great as a uh, future proofing option. Absolutely, yes. If you know yeah. you want to have children quite mm -hmm. close in age, but it is your first, you can have it as a mono. Um, and you are looking at £1,095 for the mono. Now that's in the aluminium and the grey melange. Grey melange, yeah. It varies on pricing on which colours, but that is the current RRP. Um, and then the duo, so it's say for in this mode, you want um, one, so you, Bugaboo is like a one frame, two fabrics. Mm -hmm. So what you get is two frames, but only one of those frames can have the seat on. And then the other frame will have a carry cot and a seat option. That's so it. that's... That's if you say you have an older child, but you're, having, you're due to have another baby soon. Yes. You yeah. don't need that second seat to have the carry cot option no. as well. So you won't get the carry cot fabric itself. You just use your same fabric from the yeah. carry cot which you had for your first child on again. And you'll get a separate seat fabric for when your second frame for your older child Yeah, as so well. you'll get one carry cot fabric, two seat unit fabrics, don't you, it. with it? That's what you'll yeah. get. And that's £1,335. Mm -hmm. um, and then twin, so... As twins. you can imagine, you get two of absolutely everything. Two carry cots, two seats. Mm -hmm. It's quite um, nice, you don't have to worry about buying anything separate. If you go for the twin mode, you've got everything, everything yeah. Everything, um, and that's 1,450 for that one. So not too bad, not too, no. not too bad. A um, lot of people, something that people aren't aware of necessarily is the weight distribution on the seats. Mm -hmm. So when the seat is in the parent facing position, it can only hold up to 15 kilograms in weight. Once and this is quite, to be honest, most people probably would have child world facing, maybe at around yeah. 15 kilograms anyway. Mm -hmm. But say if child's over 15 kilograms, they will need to go then world facing and they can stay in that position till 22 kilograms. 
So, and that's each seat. Yeah, it's just to do with the weight distribution, just how the seats recline, yeah. how they sit. But, you know, mm. as I said, not a lot of people know that. So it's no. quite nice that we have these little random snippets that yeah. are available, which is really, really nice. But the fabrics are nice and easy to um, put on and put off. They're not too difficult. No. Your carry cots are only suitable, suitable for supervision sleeping, and that's the manufacturer itself that are saying that. You do get the nice big hoods as well. So if you want a nice standard hood, you've got a nice size all together. Yeah. If you want it expanded, you just unzip and you've got complete coverage if you needed, plus a nice big ventilation. Another little trick I do like with the bugaboo hoods itself is because they're flexible, so they've got three little poles itself which go through the main system. If, for instance, when we go out to pubs or restaurants, you can anchorage half a hood up so you can still keep an eye on baby without having the whole hood up, hood down, hood up, hood down. Yeah. And has a nice little natural bend and you can still protect him from the other side as well, which I think is really, really handy. Again, it's something that you don't necessarily think about until you use it. Yeah. I only knew about it because my cousin done it when we went to um, TGIF and I was like, Actually, that's a really clever idea. Yeah, it is, yeah. It is really nice. Not that my cousin doesn't have lots of other ideas, but yeah. That, was <laughs> that is one of your good ideas. That's it. You can change the height of the handle. Just open the sides of the um, push chair, and you can change it to go higher if needed, or you can bring it low itself. Yeah. Easy enough to then pick the right position and lock her into place. Your brake is on your left-hand side, and it is a kick down, and she is a kick up. But she's not a too heavy kick up. So no. if you are wearing flip flops or soft shoes, it's a nice one to relax yeah. back up again, which is quite Definitely. nice. Now, fold in the push chair. Whoops, a daisy. Some people just, and while you're just uh, taking names off, some people are just asking the width. So the width in single mode, um, you are looking at 60 centimetres, and then in double mode, it's 74 centimetres wide. So it depends. <laughs> Obviously, fitting through doorways. It mm -hmm. goes through our store doorways, which is a single door opening. Um, the only thing you need to be mindful of is obviously the hoods and things. Yeah, just because they sort of stick out a little bit more from the seats itself, yeah. you might just bump them in a little bit. But as long as you're careful, it shouldn't do any damage to the fabric itself. People are loving the extendable hoods. Mm -hmm. I like the hoods of them. I think they're very nice. So, fold. What Sorry, I didn't know about the hoods either, so she's uh, learning. See, there we go. So, I usually just put the handle down to the lowest. You don't have to. But I bring it down low so then it makes a smaller footprint when it is in the car. Yeah. So you don't have to worry about extra storage or how it's going to fit in. It's nice and small. Yeah. At the very, very back of the handle, you've got two little triggers. There's a little white button, a uh, black, sorry, button that you want to press and then squeeze up. So press, squeeze up. That brings your handle down and then you grab the middle. So nice and easy. It's probably not one of the smallest. No. Fold, but but it is for a side by side. It's pretty compact. You because you can take the seat units off as well. You've got your frame, and then you can place the seats however you need to in the car, yeah. which is quite nice. So it's not like competing with one of our bigger ones, which all fold with the seat together. This one you can change it round to make it a bit more easier fitting in, yeah. which is really really nice. People a couple of people are asking, does it come in different colours? Yeah, you can have it in a black frame or an aluminium frame, mm -hmm. um, and it also comes in different colours. So for example, they do grey melange. They've got the black. You can buy different hoods as well, which is great. You um, can have it. Per you can do like your own little personalised colours, which is quite can. nice. Yeah, you can, which is lovely. Um, people, could be asking what the prize is. So the prize today um, is the um, BB Hug Me um, Pregnancy and Nursing Pillow, uh, where it's up to one hundred and thirty pounds, um, and it's a really nice one, very plush, very. It's quite a large one as well, so great. We've had a lot of people saying they need one. Um, if you just find out you're pregnant and things. Absolutely. Multi uses, as from your bottom to your sleeping with. Yeah. Everything. So, no, I, if I had to have a double push chair, I think I'd go for the donkey. Yeah. Yeah. Nice and easy to use, it's not too difficult. It's very flexible. If somebody mm. says, I want one that, because obviously, as you can probably tell here, a lot of these, um, say a lot of them, all of them, <laughs> um, the seats are all world facing. Yes. Donkey is the only one that gives you that flexibility to Absolutely. allow you to have the seat facing you, um, which is great. It's quite nice because, again, obviously, after six months when they're out wearing the carry cot, you know, you still want them facing you. Yeah. So the main carry cot for your donkey is from birth to six months, nine kilograms. Then after they've outgrown it, you then come into your main push chair seat. And again, as Georgia said, you can have them facing you, which is a nice little feature. You can detach the bumper bar if you needed, and it is an open swing gate. Yeah. Or, because there's a nice bit of a gap between it, depending on child, 
you could maybe slide them in as well, which yeah. is quite nice. It's quite a nice gap between the bumper bar, isn't it? Absolutely, there? absolutely. And nice hold-out harnesses, which is quite nice. Because no one likes to sit in a push chair after a certain age. Yeah, no. I'd like to, but that's yeah. just because I'm lazy. When you get older, then you're like, oh, I really want yeah, to go I in it. Yeah, I want to go sit in that one. And you can lock your front wheels as well. All the wheels that we're, a uh, majority of the wheels we're looking at today are your hard foam ones, which is really, really nice and easy, nice terrain wheels. Uh, we do have an airfield one as well, just because of the model and the design of it. But it's nice and easy to lock, yeah. and it puts it all into place. Which is really, really handy. Interesting fact, um, Andrew said fits in my mum's Vauxhall Corsa and the back wheels come off as well. So yeah, the back wheels can be taken mm -hmm. off, quick released off, um, if you needed to take them off, obviously to take the whip. Absolutely. Do you have to buy a basket separately? No, no. so with our, if you mean the basket at the bottom, we um, ours went off unfortunately to a, to a customer um, as a spare. So we, ours doesn't physically have it. No. Um, and then the additional will. basket when you have it in single mode comes included, doesn't it? Absolutely, even if you have it in whatever mode, it comes with a basket yeah. and you will get the lower basket. So your side basket take up to 10 kilograms and your bottom basket can take 10 kilograms as well. Yeah. But you will, you're completely basket covered. Which you is are. Nice. <laughs> Any other questions with the donkey? Are we quite all right at the moment? Great value. People are just saying they really love it. Mm -hmm. Great value for money. Which is the slimmest out of all the doubles? I'd probably say you're out and about, I think, if what I had to be. about the Cassato? Side by side, it's either you're out and about and all your Cassato wish to double at the back here, which mm. we'll get to in a moment. Um, but yeah, really great. People are living. Um, Leanne says she had this pram for her baby and two year old. I love the fact that you can face each other in the toddler seat. It yeah. is, that is nice, isn't it? Absolutely, absolutely. It just it gives you to do everything you need. Plus, you also have the option if you want to put car seats on here. So, yeah. if you want one, uh, car seat. one car seat and the child seat, you can do, or twins, you can have two car seats, or you can have a car seat and a carry cot, depending on what you yeah. want to do. You have very that flexibility, flexible, which yeah. is really, really nice, especially for a double push chair. They nice. have got their own, so they've got the Bookable Turtle car seat, mm -hmm. but you can put any Maxi Cozy um, car seat, and they also um, have approved a Be Safe and Cybex as well. Yeah, so a good, good range of, of car seats mm. itself. Look at the out and about. Yeah, so this is the out and about um, Nipper V4 double. Mm -hmm. Um, and it's a, re it's a really nice one, isn't it? Great it is. as, a, as a standard and a really affordable price for a double. So mm -hmm. pricing of this one, you are looking at um, currently an offer for £429. Should be £599. Not bad. So good Not price bad. and good offer on there. Absolutely. Yeah. Get the nice big hoods and they do cover quite a bit, which is really, really nice. Yeah. Plus you get obviously little side pockets if needed or your extra storage at the very, very top as well which is nice no extra storage parts you don't think about but they've thought about that for you and you do get it each side as well so you can pack your hoods up to the nines yeah you do get a little peekaboo window because obviously now we are going world facing naturally with the seats you do get a nice peekaboo window on the very very top the seats are from birth so they can lay all the way flat to lay them flat it's just the cord at the very very back so you want to squeeze pull and then the seat obviously once there's weight in there we'll be able to pull it am i going back you might need a bit of encouragement there obviously with child's weight in there it wouldn't actually just Hold go the back weight down. so seats are approved from birth they lay nice and flat and you do get the liner included as well i do like nice. how for a newborn baby that will keep them nice and cushioned won't yes it? absolutely it's nice definitely to have the side and a little support at the very top Again, obviously, you can put a carry cot on here as well. So it gives you another option if you wanted. You can yeah. have a baby facing you for the first six months. Yeah. And then after six months, you're going to go into your main world-facing seat, which is yeah. quite nice. You can obviously have the older child next door as well, and they can sort of see what's going on. Or from twins again, they can both lay flat yeah. if you wanted to. These wheels are your air-filled tyres itself. Um, so they shouldn't necessarily pop or get any punctures, but no. you can always take with you a puncture repair kit just in case. It's always better to be safe than sorry sometimes, especially if you're out on a long trip or, yeah. or whatever kind of You don't of want to be stranded somewhere with a, a flat tyre, that's for no. sure. No, it's like with a normal car, it's like, oh, how do I do this, how do I do that? Yeah. Be prepared. Oh, I've been there, been there, no. <laughs> that one had to rescue you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Kirsty had to come to rescue, bless her. You don't necessarily, you can buy if you want a basket on the very bottom, but you do get a little basket section just on the back of the seat itself. 
on the drawstring to put bits and pieces. So I'd say your outback nipper is definitely more for those rough roading. So if yeah. you parks, uh, like your farms, your horses, those kind of bits Yeah, and if pieces. you are very kind of rural and, yeah. and very um, outdoorsy, it's a really great one. because mm -hmm. um, I think we shared a picture on our Facebook, literally, of someone that it was really dirty after a walk and they just literally hosed it down, cleaned it all down and it was good to Don't go. Exactly very hard wearing material. Mm -hmm. Um, Royals love a bit of out and about. I was like, I think do. Zara Tindall had one, didn't she? Yeah, yeah, we've seen Kate Middleton as well. So there's been quite a lot of people that had. Um, you had yeah. um, a nipper for Talia. Yeah, so, so when I was nanny and I used the, um, uh, yeah, it was the nipper. Um, and it was, a, yeah, it's great, a so push light up. and mm -hmm. easy to push. And those air fills wheels do make it a lot easier to kind of maneuver, which is great. Um, each seat will take from birth up to 22 kilograms, which is quite nice. That's a very good weight to itself. It doesn't um, maybe look it, but no. it does take a very good weight. Yeah, if you think this will be where their feet will reach as they get older, mm -hmm. which is great. Um, but it's just nice and simple. My, I love the, I lo used to love these. The little side the little pockets. pockets. To kind of keep anything easy access. Snacks again. Snacks. You know, I like a snack. <laughs> you know, you know, I like a snack. You can change the position of the handle, and this time it's more of a pivot itself. So you can just change it to depending on what feels easier to push, and you've got the nice easy buttons on the very, very inside itself. So nothing is too difficult with this push here, which is really, really nice itself. You do get some nice suspension. Your brake is at the very middle, and you can just flip flop it down and then pivot it just on top to release it. So nice and easy. Nice time if you obviously use sandals, or soft shoes. Um, it's nice and easy to work, which is lovely. But yeah, good good bit of suspension yeah. if you are off-roading. Yeah, and it's it's got a nice, if anyone's obviously had the nipper before, the fold is the exact same, isn't it? That's it. Exact same fold. So just need to make sure, oops, your seats are up. Yeah. Ashley said, take it the right other colours that other colours that they come in, I can see them hanging on the handle. Yes, there are different <laughs> colours. Ah, well spotted. <laughs> <laughs> Lots of different colours they come in, so from really bright red, mm -hmm. they're bright green as well. Yeah. Um, and then punch. this is the royal blue, mm -hmm. I believe. Um, and then you've got um your steel grey. Lots of colour choices. Uh, sure, yeah, pebble nice. punch, which is the one that um, um I had, so that's really good. So to fold the push chair, you open your flaps on the actual side of the push chair itself. Then from there, you want to release the catch and then bend down. Yeah, it'll kind of chair. naturally kind of take itself down and clip into place. So folds nice and easy. It's not too bad a size. No, it's just pretty flat, but it's obviously naturally wider because it's a double push chair, not a single. You could always maybe remove the bumper bar if you needed to, but yeah. it, it's got something there to lift with. So if you need to lift something, you've automatically mm. got a handle straight there for you. But it goes nice, and if I can lay it down. So, make, uh, so Claire said this is great for the beach, yeah? Yep, yeah, absolutely. Always, if you go, do go to the beach with any of the push chairs, even doubles or singles, just make sure you clear that sand out. Cause yeah, because it can get grit. into the brake. And... Although, it won't do on two others that we've got here. No. <laughs> oh, three. Mm. Maybe. <laughs> so there's a few that won't go in. It catches just on your right hand side. Now, you have got multitude little gaps for it to click into. So maybe if you've got stuff in the basket and it may be a little bit more puffier yeah. out, it will still connect but it might not go as small, but you don't have to worry about it coming back out no. on you, which is quite nice. Pull that catch out, release your leg, and then pull everything back up into place. I know, place. it's a weird thing. I like the noise it makes when it comes up. The click, 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 click. I noise. think it's just a reassurance that you are doing it right. <laughs> <laughs> when you don't hear it, you're like, ah. It's quiet, what's it doing? It's not moving. And then just make sure you cap your closed on the side again. Yeah, you're nice safety catches there you set off with child in tow. Yeah. What do we think of this one? Um, it's, I can't remember who said, I think it was me, Mealy. I think it's what I said that, Miley. Um, it's her favourite twin. Ah, very so nice. Far, so yeah, she really likes this one. Mm -hmm. um, Ashley likes the click as well. Yeah, sometimes you need, it's nice to hear it, even though you've got visual, yeah. it's nice to have it for hearing as well, just so you know. You are doing things right. It's that like you do seatbelt, you hear the click and you're like, yeah, yeah I'm all, all secured, I'm all safe to do so. Which yeah. is lovely. 
Nice bit of suspension, obviously air for wheels as we've discussed. And you do get a nice big foot plate for when they can put their feet. Because a lot of the time children are going to climb into a pushchair. Yeah, so great that's... to kind of have that foot plate. And it's plastic, so it's going to be easy to wipe down, mm -hmm. easy to clean as well, which is great. Uh, so um, standard five point harness. Yeah, I think people are, are liking this one. It is a nice one to look at. Mm -hmm. um, Sarah said she ruined her first pushchair on the beach. Sand yeah. everywhere. See, that's it. Look after the push share or the product and it'll look after you. That's, yeah. that's the ways. <laughs> so no, it's nice, it's nice and light, not too heavy. No. Again, obviously we haven't got any weight in there, but it's not it's too It's nice to have it as a light push share mm -hmm. to start with, yeah. um, which is great. Louise says it looks fantastic for country walks, yeah. Absolutely. Even dog walking, is that a bit dog walking? Yeah, dog walking would be great. Emma Hill said, this is typical. My sister-in-law is being induced today with twins. The only day she's not been able to come onto this page. Oh. It's okay, because you've commented for her. Exactly. It's all good. <laughs> she can always re-watch it later if you wanted. <laughs> yeah, so you, she's in the chance to win the pillow, but obviously she, this, these, all our videos, they yeah. will go on to our Facebook page. So you can go back and re-watch them, which is great, because mm -hmm. we do cover a lot of product um, on these lives. Absolutely. So, like in the nipper. Yeah. Did you want me to go through the baby joggers? Yeah, have a play with your joggers. Let you have the iPad. <gasps> Get in charge of the iPad again. I know. So we have got two baby joggers here because they, two, they do multiple different machines, they don't do, they? They do, yes. But these are the two doubles we have out in store. We have got your baby jogger um, city mini double. Mm -hmm. And then you've got your baby jogger city mini GT2 double. There's lots of... Um, um, essentially, it's kind of their upgrade, isn't it? The GT2. Yes. A bit more of a rough roading one, yeah. maybe, to compare to the, the City Mini one. Yeah. Uh, the, yeah. Yeah, model. City Mini. Yeah. <laughs> it is City Mini. That's what confuses me. City Mini, City Mini GT2. Yeah, it's like, it's like too many GTs in yeah. all one places. You were going to say something. Um, Louise Lou has just said, does this fold any flatter? Which I'm assuming she means with the out and back. It doesn't, unfortunately. That no. is the size when it is folded. Um, oh, and Claire has just said, um, and out and about, do a professional cleaning service and they will charge for any broken parts as well. So they there are. You go. I mean, their customer service is great, isn't it? I was going to say, it's always good when you don't have to deal with the customer services because then you know they're yeah. a good product, a good brand, which is lovely. Yeah, we don't have to. There's not many problems anyway, is there? No, at all? absolutely, absolutely. So as you can see, on here I have got one set up as seat and one as carry cot. Because you have that ability on here, you can have two carry cots on here um, or you can obviously have the one. Mm -hmm. As well, you can also get car seat, adap car seat adapters to have the car seat on here as well, which is great. Um, now, obviously, with the double carry cots, um, we did mention, obviously, with the out about they have a carry cot as well. But they are a little bit more narrow because, obviously, it's got to fit in that narrow seat, in a sense, because it's a double. Mm -hmm. But um, it's really great kind of size um, on here. You will have adapters, but we've just obviously popped it into place just to show you. Louise said the carry cot looks so snug. It uh, is. Keely has said it looks so stylish. Um, Eileen, I think it is. Um, she's asked, are the seats only world facing on these, which I'm assuming yeah. you're now looking at the out and about and the other ones? Yes, they are. So the donkey is the only one where the seat can be parent facing. Absolutely. Um, on the other ones, they are all world facing. Mm -hmm. But the carry cut's really nice, plush material, nice and soft. Um, and I like the fact that you kind of keep a lot of the same sort of features. So the extendable sun visor there. And you can put the hood back in that mid position, obviously if you're not wanting it all the way down, but still to give a little one a bit, a bit more protection, a bit more coverage, you can do. Or you can say have it all the way down as well. Clips into place and back up. But you can say you do have adapters so you can pop them on the push chair seat. But if not, you have then got um, your two seats here. So, so this is as it will come. Louise has just asked a question, which I think we're going to answer in a minute. Can the main seat be used from birth? Yes, it can. <laughs> you nearly took the words out of my mouth, Louise. Um, but yes, the seats themselves um, can go from birth. Um, just mind the fact this obviously hasn't got the hood on. It's just because we've had the carry cot there. But your seats, um, they go from birth and they will last up to 22 kilograms per seat. So great, again, great. Uh, weight limit on there, but also they're nice long seats, as you can, fingers crossed you can probably pick up. Um, they are very, very long. Key Marie, uh, again, she's asked what this, uh, can the seats go up to, uh, so from birth to 22 kilograms. Yeah. Uh, and it's got, it looks, uh, Liz Charlton, I think it is? Yeah. It looked narrow. Um, does it go to the same age? Yeah. Yeah. So both same weight limit, mm -hmm. um, and to be honest, they're wider seats than the out and about. Yeah. 
um, the slightly wider seat. So that's the only thing to be very mindful of if you are looking for, si like, for example, side by sides in general, their seats are more narrow. Absolutely, absolutely. It's just what happens um, because otherwise you're going to be left with a really big double. They've made the compromise enough to to meet most people's, yes. um, like the child's weight and, and things like, like that. Um, but yeah, obviously, they'll be really big, obviously, if they have two full seats mm -hmm. um, in there. But looking at some of the features on the seat and the hoods, you do get a nice big hood extension. It's a nice hood. And you have your Velcro with your peekaboo window. But you get two, which I quite like, because it yes. means then if you took in it away, you don't need the full extension. No, you, you still, still keep got it. visibility. You still keep that visibility to see your little one mm -hmm. when they are in that world facing position. Uh, so you have Claire got likes one. the black and the blue together, which is yeah. really nice. Uh, Eliza, we will show the fold in just one moment. It's a magic fold. It's very, very good. Ooh, very, very good fold. Um, Louise is great for nap times as she doesn't like it when the seats don't go all the way flat. So these do allow it to go nice and flat, which yeah. is lovely. You can roll up the back, great for those summer months, obviously to have all that ventilation in there. Um, it just means obviously, little ones on those warmer days, they're having all that breathable uh, air through there, so it's not too hot, no. and it will kind of help regulate their temperature, because you'll know, children aren't great at doing that. <laughs> exactly. Well, Louise and I, do we both have a favorite out of these? Out of all of these, or between the jogger, the baby jogger options? Yeah, let's know. Um, like you mentioned before, you had you would have a donkey, wouldn't you? Yeah. Um, we know Laura like our Laura likes a baby jogger. It's difficult. If I knew I was having, um, to be if, yeah, I think if I knew I was having twins, mm -hmm. I'd probably go for something like baby jogger. To be honest, I do quite like it. Um, but if I was having like if I had two quite close in age, I'd probably go for donkey because yeah. the flexibility Get that to bring it down away. to single. There was one, uh, Fran Locks, can the baby jogger take two car seats? It can only take one, unfortunately, just to do with the width of the car seat itself. Yeah. Um, so you can have, obviously, the newborn flat seat and then the car seat on there if you needed to. Yeah. It's just because of the size, unfortunately, to fit both yeah. car, uh, car, car seats, seats on. Um, and then Kimari, is it sunproof? Yes. Yeah, UV50 protected. Which is really nice. Nice little features they have with them. Yeah. At the back of the seat, each seat, you do also get... Um, a net pocket, so great to kind of put, so maybe rain cover, yeah, <clears throat> something like that in the back. Food, food, snacks. We you like know me. Food. No, I like a snack. You do. Um, but your to push your seats up, they're just with a drawstring, so you can just push those up into place, um, and then you have full access, obviously, to the back of your push chair, <laughs> and obviously to your basket. Fiona Curry she says, "How much was the out and about? I'm trying to get my husband, my partner, to buy it." <laughs> so the out and about was it's 429 i think 429 pounds at the moment so yeah. um get him on that <laughs> yeah while it's on offer it should be 599 that persuade him is that this good know. price good price yeah it's currently on offer so we need to get it now <laughs> yeah <laughs> um so yeah you have got a nice big basket at the bottom we just had obviously our hood in there but it is a good size you can kind of put most things um very baguette friendly yeah we love a baguette see it goes back to food again yeah you know us we, we do know like us food. well um, but yeah, looking at the seats, so they are nice long seats, um, and they do have, if I show on here, um, your five point harness, and it is really easy to work. Just going to interject quickly while you're doing that. Steph has asked how much the carry cots are. We can let you know at the very, very end. We can sort of add it onto our link when we've finished, just so you yeah. have an idea of some of the costs for the carry cots. Yeah. Uh, Keely likes the sound of the out and about price. It's very reasonable. Yes, it is. yes, it is. Uh, Sarah Jane, um, Viscom Morton. I really enjoy these lives. Thank you for doing them. You're more than You're welcome. welcome. Is there anything else you want to see? Any recommendations of any products that you want to know a bit more information on? We're more than happy to take yeah. any recommendations. Let us know our, um, what was Kelly's guru? Oh, social media social guru. Media guru. <laughs> You can never get it wrong, can, can you? Like, I just go, yeah, Kelly, can we do this? The guru computer media <laughs> thingy. Fix it out of her, then. You can always let her know, and she can always schedule them into the live. Yeah, so really just send nice. a message to our Facebook page, and we can obviously absolutely, absolutely. access it through there. 
Any other questions? Um, <laughs> no, I just got that. Uh, sorry. Jordan. It looked like you were going to say something. Uh, Louisa said, the only thing that worries me is the size going through shots, but hopefully it would fit through most places. Yeah. It would fit majority of places, and obviously a lot more shops now have to be um, I'd mainly wheelchair friendly. Yeah. So they should be able to fit in, no issues at all, even around like yeah. uh, clothes shops or anything like that. There should always be maneuverability around them, which is quite nice. Go oldie woldie. Yeah, shops. that's what I was going to say. It's yeah. more kind of like your countryside if you're going into those older buildings. Absolutely. You may if you struggle. go to York, probably not going to get that inside <laughs> a York shop itself. But it's all right. Normal place. Yeah. You'll be absolutely fine. Go to one of the outlets. There's no issues there. <laughs> no issues there. Um, you have got access to um, be able to put the seat in the upright position, or as you can see, we have it um, the leg rest down as well. And it's just with a little stand in here. So you want to push that out and then you can just click that into place zara said i think when uh, when i need a stroller for grandparents i'd like the out and about very very grandparent friendly yeah definitely not too difficult not too heavy either no fits in a good majority of vehicles itself yeah it's a great, I said that great now then i'll bite myself and be like darn it no it doesn't <laughs> it is a great all-rounder really to be honest it's a nice one to look at um i like the fact you can lift this up and then have full access to your basket from the front um as well just means obviously um because obviously with the seats in the reclined position, they've mm -hmm. kind of made sure to add that feature in here because you can't access it from the back if the seats are in the lie flat position. The only thing is if they're asleep. That's my only, the only concern. You kind of got to move that while they're That'd be asleep. fine. She's like, we got this, guys. Don't you worry. It's very quiet. <laughs> uh, jo Joanne Matson, I think it is. She said, great store and great customer services. Oh, so thank, thank you. you for that one. Keely, can't wait to go shopping again. Children asleep in the prams. Fingers crossed. Yeah. <laughs> um, Elena, I wish I could get the donkey, but it doesn't fit through my doors. If you give us your measurements, we can always confirm that if needed be for that point. Um, Rach, Emma, I have yeah. the out and about and love it. It all, almost walks itself, even with yeah, the bigger does, children yeah. in it. So easy to push, Yeah, which is really, really nice. And she hasn't found a door that it doesn't fit through. No, it's so that's it always a good, good, good point. It's a nice all rounder, isn't it? Absolutely. Um, Great, they found a way to add storage in there. I think it's always the way with double push chairs. Sometimes you have to lose a little bit of storage for that space. So it's nice they've gone, you know what, we're going to lift the legs up. So again, accessibility <laughs> is nice, nice and easy. Um, Unless snack, you're weak, like me this morning. Snack compartments are essential. I have the Joy Push Chair cup holder, and in between it has compartments for M&Ms. Yep, I don't mind M&Ms. Oh, I like an M&M. I like a peanut M&M. Oh, no, I'm a crispy M&M. Oh, no, I'm peanut. Or chocolate. There we you got go. it. See, she's the strong one today. <laughs> there you go. Thanks, Kirsty. You're more than welcome, my lovely. Absolutely fine. And then the fold of this is really simple. If you know most baby jogger, they are kind of fold mechanism in mm -hmm. the seats. Yep. And all you have in the seats, um, one on each side, is pull to fold. It is as simple as that. So this is the magic fold. You've just literally pull, and then oh, I'll be my hood. <laughs> That'll be the hood that's in the back. <laughs> Thanks, go, Kirsty. Lovely. You're welcome. And then, and down it will go. So that is a very, very small double push chair that goes from birth to 22 kilograms right yep. there. Great, and it folds so easy if the hood's not obviously in the basket. Um, <laughs> and then, need to empty basket. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, it is a really simple one because it's a double. I like the fact they've thought about the easiest way for people to be able to pick it up and fold mm -hmm. it. So they have use the center of the push chair so you haven't got all the weight on one side. Absolutely, absolutely. Uh, Rebecca Pearson says, I have a mountain buggy duet and it fits through um, any single doorway, which is really handy. Yeah. Um, crispy M&Ms all the way is from Keeley. Now we're back on to food. Back on to M&Ms. We do love a few. Uh, Fiona, does the out and about come with a rain cover? You yes. Got, yes, it does. Yeah, yeah. yeah out and about comes with the rain cover. Um, you can, the only thing is if you have a carry cut on there, so you would have to buy an extra rain cover. It's the XL rain cover um, because obviously it's going to be bigger with mm -hmm. the carry on. Absolutely. But That's the only thing. But as standard, no, you, you, it comes included. Uh, Stacey, wow, amazing. Fast fold. Yeah, I know. Once you do it right. Exactly. <laughs> uh, Claire Henson, what is the cheapest du double in the live today? I think it is the Joy Air. Yes, it will be. Yeah. 150 pounds, 149. Yeah, so Joy, we haven't got that just yet, Claire, but um, it is will one of the most joy. usual ones on there. Um, they have definitely thought about the good fold, way it folds. Yeah. Weight is desirable, which is really, really nice. It is. Uh, quick and compare, so quick compared to others, absolutely. 
Everyone's loving the fold. Um, Ashley has said, what did I miss about the M&Ms? <laughs> There's a pocket to put them in. <laughs> Basically, we've gone back to food and any kind of storage, we're putting food in there. Yeah. M&Ms, candies. I don't mind a bit of like the chewy candies. Just turn American and now, apparently. Chewy candy. Sweets, uh, you mean? Sweets. sweets, candy, candy cane. I love a candy. Candy cane? At uh, Christmas, it's called a candy cane. Yeah, but that's one item. You can't say, hey, all sweets are candy. We go to a candy shop. A sweet shop. It's a candy shop. <laughs> She's turned American. She's gone to America too many times. <laughs> Can I go to America? <laughs> <laughs> um, so, yeah, it's a really, really nice push chair. And George has just shown nice and easy fold, nice big hoods. And yeah. it takes a maximum of 22 kilograms. You've got the option of having a car seat on there or a carry cot. Um, yeah. You can't necessarily take off the fabrics easy to have a naked frame um, for a no. double push chair. Um, so it would be having the fabric still on there with the carry cots attached. Yeah. The fabrics are sort of hand washable, which is really nice and easy, which is the same for a majority of yeah. the push chairs we've got. Your handle is of one height, so it doesn't change um, in, in angle or anything like that, but it is pretty standard um, most heights. The only thing is if you are on the shorter side, it may not be suitable, just because the pusher itself and the handle is quite high. Mm -hmm. um, and on the this one, you do get your double wheels. So you have those double wheels at the front. Um, so kind of you do get a little bit more control with it because yeah. the fact you have the double wheel ability um, on here. And then you can lock each wheel as well. Um, Amelia Newton said, great design. It is indeed. Yeah. Nice and easy. Nice yeah, and really easy. easy and simple. And then you have got um, the City Mini GT2 version. Now you're going to so, regret locking those front wheels. <laughs> I am. Scooting through. So on this one has like a bit of an upgrade almost and has some slight differences. So Steph has just asked, can two carry cots fit on? Again, I don't think you can. I think it's just one and then the seat. Um, I might be wrong. Um, I want to say you can. Can? I'm pretty sure you can get two on here because... Is it tight or is it okay? The only thing is, if you think about it, you can get your adapters here, but obviously that's where your adapter's going to sit. It will be fairly tight, but I think you can have two. But so can, but a bit of a tight Yeah, if you are wanted to, what we can do is send a message to our Facebook page and we can triple check that for you. Mm -hmm. um, but I want to say you can have two on there. If not, the way they've been going this morning, they have been answering people back. I was going to say, yeah, someone said that you can get obviously a snack tray for the Bobby Donkey, yeah. which you can, which is really, really nice. We really handy it with people on there that can kind um, of get to questions before we Absolutely. Can. I'd like to say we can Google while we're chatting to give the answers, but I'm like, I'd probably break it. <laughs> so we won't Should do... Should lose you all. Yeah, exactly. I'd be like, yeah, something's happening with Facebook and I don't really know why. <laughs> um, but yeah. Great designs, nice, really easy to push about. Looks really good. Thanks for the awesome demo. Awesome demo as always. This is from Josh. Oh, thank you, is Josh. Nice. Is Josh, that Josh Josh Joshy? Josh Joshy. <laughs> yeah, I get used to these people on the, uh, every day. Thank um, you, Josh. Ashley has says, does the car seat go on this? Yes, it does. And you can get the uh, baby jogger own car seat, which does attach quite nicely, which is really handy. And it's a nice light car seat as mm, well, which is absolutely. great. Absolutely. Um, but yeah, on here, we have got the adapters on this one. Mm -hmm. And then they've got the carry cart in place. So it does sit at a nice height. So the carry cart um, for this one is £199 to give you a bit of an idea. The round that sort of price yes, in. Yes, yeah. Um, I think the single ones are 219 I want Just to say. it's a little bit bigger itself. It's a little bit bigger, a bit of a bigger carry cart. Um, but yeah, it is a nice um, nice size again, got all the same sort of features um, of the fact that you can obviously take your hood down. Getting some love for the donkey. Vicky Cummins, donkey is far best. People are loving uh, the donkey. Gemma, still love the donkey. I like the donkey. Yeah, very. it's the most flexible, most, um, what's the word? Got as many configurations, should I say? Yes. Yeah, most. I, could, I couldn't even think of the word to give you a hand there. We're, so we're now like, having the best morning this morning. We're both like, what's going on? Go with it. It's Monday morning. We're Absolutely. all tired. Um, but taking this off, you've just got your little hand slots here, um, and they will take it off on the adapters. But it's so light. Um, on its own, it's very, very light. Very easy to take off, on and off, and easy to manoeuvre. Mm -hmm. And then all you want to do is just take your adapters off. So grey button and slide off. Everything's nice and easy. There's nothing too difficult, not too fiddly. No. It does it all for you, which is really, really nice. Yeah, so some of the differences, as you can probably tell, um, it's very, very similar, but mm -hmm. you have got your single wheels on here rather than those double wheels, because um, this is their City Mini GT version. To lock your wheels, you just want to push your button and slide across. So it's a slightly different way of doing it. Um, um, Emily Newton said it looks super light. It is, yeah. It's really easy to manoeuvre. It's not quite as light as something like you're out and about, but it is still a nice... Alina says I second that. So very nice light push, yeah. Yeah. Um, you've got... 
Obviously, again, because we've had the carry cot in, we've only got the one hood, but you can obviously have the two hoods with the two um, peekaboo windows. This time there's magnets rather than the Velcro. So a little bit more of a luxurious feel to this one. Gemma, uh, Gemma, Gemma, blah, blah, blah. Gemma Stanley, donkey's lovely. I think the colour you have out today and the white frame sold it to me. You're very welcome, Gemma. <laughs> yeah, so that's the grey melange on aluminium chassis, but you can also have a black chassis. Depending on which one you want, which is nice. Uh, did we get the price for the double city? Oh, no, I don't think we no. did. How See, naughty. I'm slacking. This is what it is. So the Baby Jogger um, City 2, which Georgia just demonstrated five, a couple of minutes ago, is £519. Yeah. So again, a nice price, which can obviously have two um, newborns up to 22 kilogram on there. The one that Georgia is about to play with now is 500, so it's on offer, sorry, for £535.20 instead of £669. Yeah. Good discount. Especially for a good yeah. push chair. I think out so the there's not much different, so to be honest, no. I, would, I personally would go pay for that upgrade and go I'll for go GT. the GT. Yeah. Just because it feels nicer to push, it's got a few different features, which Absolutely. is great. Um, you have got on this one the chance to bring your hand to a lower height, but also you can have it really high as well. So great for taller parents, mm -hmm. um, which is, yeah, just really handy, obviously, no matter which height you are. You too, do still keep the ventilated window at the back which you can tie up out of the way um alina i think it is what uh, what's the difference between the wheels what's the difference in the wheels so your wheels on here as you can see on the um baby jogger city double um you have got those double wheels so you have four wheels at the front um and they're very similar sizes but they've got more of a plastic coating on them where as on your um, baby jogger city mini gt2 you have your two single wheels, but they have more suspension and kind of a bit more of an upgraded um, material on there. Just to make it's a bit more premium. Again, it's a bit more of a tread on there. Just yeah. looks a bit nicer and it will push a little bit nicer as well. Joshy Josh said, I'm surprised at the price. I thought it would be a lot more. Definitely worth for the upgrade. Yeah. Um, Jenny Roberts, they're all good in their own ways. They I, are. I think really no is perfect push chair for everyone. Absolutely, it's up to us women to have. We would have one for each day in a different terrain. Absolutely, definitely, absolutely. I, I dread the day I have a child. <laughs> we keep saying we're going to have like um, a different colour for different seasons. Yeah. You know, different for all terrain, as obviously Jenny just said. So you're going to have loads, Georgia. I will. Which would you say was the lightest out of those two? Would you say? I'd probably say, to be honest, your lightest out of the two to push would be your City Mini GT mm -hmm. 2. Yeah. Um, but yeah, they're, they're probably very similar, but because I think it's just because those, those wheels at the front, it just makes it a bit easier, so it feels a little bit lighter right. to push. Yeah, Louise Lulu, uh, which is one is the lightest, so I hope that sort of helped out with just having a push. Um, but obviously, again, if you sort of let us know on our Facebook, we can always get you the exact weights as needed, yeah. or if not, they are all on our website. Yeah, so on here again, so it's the exact same as the other one. You can have your carry cot. You can also have your car seat on here. So it'll only have one car seat. Um, or obviously your seats go from birth as well in that lie flat position. But um, you can obviously um, use it all the way up to 22 kilograms, which is fab. Franza, is there a difference in how wide between the baby joggers? I don't think there is. No, I think they're both the same yeah. width, to be honest. It's just literally your wheels and your handlebar that makes your, your biggest difference, yeah. shall we say. Your frame's got a little bit more suspension on your City Mini GT2. I say, imagine it as a bit of a, I don't know, it's like a car, isn't it? You kind of pay for the upgrade. Yes. It's almost a bit like that sort of difference. So I've got that little bit of an upgrade on here. Um, and then your fold, I'm just going to triple check there's nothing in my basket first. Is there a hood in there? <laughs> no, there's no hood in there today. No, we, must have, we might have to hunt for the hood later then. Yes, oh yeah, <laughs> we're missing a hood everyone. Um, but it's the same fold, so you just want to pull on your straps again and it'll go down. I'm just Someone like literally had just said, what's the fold like? It's the exact same. Okay. Ask and you shall receive. Yes. There we go. So that's your interplace. So there you go, Kaylee. That is your fold. <laughs> the fold is a little bit bigger just because I've got my wheels locked, but I'm just going to unlock them and you can see what it's like. But that's not too bad with the wheels locked though as well. So it's not like no. a bulk bulk. But so it makes a big bit of a difference obviously mm -hmm. once it's in the, um, the wheels are not locked. So they Claire can... loves the fold. Emily says very good. Yeah, really so nice. Easy fold, Angelie says. So they are very good. Yeah. Ashley said, how do you ladies remember everything I'll never know? 
Well, we try, we, we try, try, we try. And then throughout the day, we just have random facts and information. Yeah, don't get me wrong. I don't take much else in, in, information in. No, 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 it's just... no. Um, hard to choose. Lots of obviously different push chairs. Uh, what are the colour options? So with your... Um, Nothing bright. Baby jogger yes. don't do anything bright. It's kind of black. You've got your carbon, slate. And then you've got your carbon. slate, which is like um, a lighter grey. Would you say lighter grey kind of colouring? It's more of a charcoal -y sort of colour, mm. I'd say. Because this is your carbon, then you've got your jet, and then you've got your slate one. Yeah. So just three main colours itself. Yeah, they don't do any red, blue, pink, greens. No. They, don't, they don't do Nothing bright, bright. and bold. But then again, they're probably looking at they're going to be multi terraining so I think they're very kind of... Um, yeah, they just kind of just see it as more of a. It's not it's a, a stylish. Basic, it's not a no. stylish push chair at the end of the day. It's kind of more for purpose. Absolutely. Fran has said brilliant fast fold for when the kids are screaming in the car. Yeah. Absolutely. Absolutely. Definitely. Nice and easy. Anything nice and easy, I think, is sometimes the way to go. And sometimes it might not have either the same features or style compared to others. Yeah. But sometimes you want something nice and easy that's going to do exactly. Exactly, yeah, exactly to, what you need to. Very really nice. Um, thank you everyone that has already made a comment, but today you are in the draw to win um, the BB Hug Me nursing pillow and um, pregnancy pillow, which is great. It's worth up to £130. Um, and it's a re in a really lovely design, as you can see there. <laughs> Vicky Thomas Alms, I think it is. My husband, my hubby, uh, get annoyed with me because I know a lot about prams after having way far too many. But that's yeah, it. you have you have one. And you think, oh, I've got to go see what the other ones like, and then you keep going and going and going. Yeah, but that one's got that, and I haven't got that on mine, so I want that one now. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's it's like I want a new colour. I want this. And one there's no that. perfect push chair. If there's a perfect push chair, I think they everyone would... would be a lot more decisive on what they want. Yeah. Whereas... But variety is the spice of life. You've it got is. so many options, so different colours, folds. It's basically the best for you. That's the best for yourself. So yeah. you don't worry about what Joe Friday's got or your next door neighbours. It's got to be the best for yourself. Yeah, there's no perfect push there for everyone. No, absolutely not, absolutely not. That's it. Um, so this, we were, I know somebody mentioned in the comments before, what was our cheapest um, side by yep. side that we've got out this morning. Mm -hmm. um, it will be your Joy Air. So absolutely. Joy Air, a lot of people have heard of Joy. Yes, very good brand. Not Joey, it's no, Joy. Joy, yes. <laughs> From our previous, we may have some people watching today who learned That's how it. to say but it. Don't be, sometimes when you talk it to us and you go jo Joey and you're like, so the Joy, yeah, yeah okay. So I'll be honest, before I worked here, I called it Joey. And it, it <laughs> so took right, me, we beat that out of you, don't worry. Kirsty made sure that was out of me before <laughs> customers actually. Well, the shop opens, yeah. it's Joy, and that's it. Although, can we have a word for about Kiko? Chico. She calls it Chico, it's actually Kiko. But we know what you mean. You say snooze. it snooze. She calls it snooze. Yeah, that's just because I'm like, is it snooze, snooze, you know? So you talk to me about <laughs> Joey. <laughs> you mean Joey. <laughs> Who? Who's Joey? Who's Joey? Exactly. But yeah, really great affordable um, push, £140 for a side-by-side -side double. You can't go wrong. No, it's no. great. Um, I like the fact they think of it all. So you have, you may think one, one blue, one pink. What mm -hmm. if I want them both blue? What if I want them both pink? Don't worry. You can mix and match. They are reversible seat liners, which is great. So you can obviously have them the other way. Also great if you need, you've got almost two uses out of it. Absolutely, if one's dirty, you can always You can it flip around. it around. See, and nobody needs to know. Put it in um, the wash and yeah. They're loving the pink and the blue, which is really, really nice. Yeah. Um, Claire has a really like the Joy Think because it looks a bit more um, old fashioned double. So yeah. Like a stand, like it's a bit more classic, kind like of that. just your bog standard, great sort of mm -hmm. double, which Absolutely. is lovely. Absolutely. A super, um, obviously, versatile. I was thinking of the word then. Super yeah. versatile is what Emma said. Liz Char uh, Charlton said, is it sturdy? Yeah, it does feel very sturdy because even though it's, I say, £140, you think quality wise what, you, what we're sort of looking at. Absolutely. Um, you do obviously lose out on things like kind of more of a foam, you do just get a foam handle on things, mm -hmm. but that allows you to bring the, down the cost. But pushing, I'd say it feels very sturdy because you have four lots of double wheels. Yes. It just gives you that extra um, stability on the wheels there. Each seat will go from uh, birth to 15 kilograms, um, so they do um, recline. And it's just, if I spin around, just in the back here, it's like a clip, which I find so handy. So it's pushing your clip down. Key and Marie says it looks lightweight. It's, quite, it's quite light, it's not too heavy. No. But yeah, really easy um, to work. So that is then in the lie flat position. And I like the fact that, in a, it depends, everyone's slightly different. Mm -hmm. But I like the fact that the seats are a little bit more open between As two in children. Between seats, yeah. Because obviously, 
It depends if the children love each other or not. Sally, is there nice uh, brother and sisters or sisters and brothers? <laughs> okay, worse if they just do that and hit each other. Because that's, sibling, that's sibling love. Yeah. That's, that's how it works. Yeah, yeah. I always find it fascinating because I'm, I'm one of six. And I, mm. I, not until I've worked here, I was like, Mom, what did you do for push chairs? Like, how did you manage? Well, a lady, I think, I can't remember your name, so I do apologise, did ask if we do a, a triplet push chair. And yes, you can get one. Uh, we don't have it here, it unfortunately. It does exist. But it's a Pepperego and they do a triplet push chair. So it's a, it's a Let nice us know, one. would you like to see it? Would you like to see it in a live? We can get hold of one for... Laura Marsh, that's right. Yeah, she Laura Marsh, it. she's our... She uh, she's our triplet Pepperego yeah. push chair lady. So they do exist out there. I think she's commented on, she's on today. Oh, she very She was on anyway earlier. <laughs> I might have missed. <laughs> <laughs> she was talking about the donkey. Not yet. I think, think she's had the donkey. Yes. Am I right in thinking, I could be getting the wrong person here, but hopefully you are child minded or you look after. The um, Laura Marsh went for the um, Chico 4 in 1 because it allows to do everything that yeah. it does, which is really And she nice. said that's why she loves a donkey as well. Absolutely. But yeah, really, really nice. Big seats. They say last up to 15 kilograms, so not quite as much as some of the others that go up to 22, mm -hmm. but it is still a manual bike, two to three year old, which is great. Victoria, I love the look of the Joy as it looks light. It is it light. It is light, indeed. and it's nice and compact. You don't feel too big when pushing it. Mm -hmm. I don't feel like this feels much bigger than a, than a single, to be honest. So No, you, your stance hasn't widened out, which is yeah. quite nice. I, have, got, I can keep in the broader. same position. Um, and I do like, um, yeah, just like how it pushes, really. Debbie, I also like the children are close together with no barriers. So, yeah, like you said same before. thing. As long as they like each other. <laughs> <laughs> They'll be fine, you know. It's um, not, they'll have to learn to like each other. <laughs> people are sort of asking, obviously, you'd like to see the triple, uh, triple push it. If you go on the main Pepperego website, that is where it will be. Unfortunately, we don't have it in shop itself. But if you do go on their main website, yeah. you'll be able to see what it can do, which is really, really nice. But it's really easy to kind of have in that upright position and to really pop it in. And I, one thing I do actually really like is how far the bump bar is away. So you don't have to take that off because that will be an additional thing, obviously, when you have child. Yeah. But you can, obviously, completely swivel it out of the way. So you have to take the whole thing off. Mm -hmm. But you can take it off, obviously, with two buttons, um, one either side. Nice and easy to take on and off. Just your slide buttons. Really easy to take on and off. Um, and then back on like that. So really easy, simple to do. And then at the back, I like the basket. You have a very good basket in here. a nice size basket. It takes their big rain cover, which comes all included. It does come included. <laughs> that is our one. <laughs> but yeah, really great size. Um, you can fit plenty of things in there as you're out and about, because you probably will when you especially have two kids, children with you. Absolutely, absolutely. So yeah, really nice size in there. We've got a lot of people who are interested. Is it a small fold or is it a little bit more bigger? Ooh, I want to, am I going to keep them waiting? Key so Marie has gone, ooh, handy bar. This is a handy bar. And then your brake is just a flip-flop friendly brake. So flick on. That's what I like, but it's a nice flip-flop friendly. You don't have to worry about and kicking it off. up or anything like that. No. So really simple. And then your fold is simple as well. It's just... One thing about Joy, they make things, they don't have to overcomplicate things. No, absolutely. So to fold, you've just got these two buttons on here. So you want to pull out the safety catch, then squeeze your button in, and then what you do is kind of take in that push chair um, forward to the ground and down. So, so you can nice see how flat, flat that yeah. is. It is so flat. Um, you have got two catches that you can twizzle around. Um, to keep the push chair locked, but say really easy, really mm. simple to work, isn't it? Absolutely, it's not too difficult, and it's not one of those, if you're having a bad day, or you don't, you know, everything's going on, it's simple, it's easy, you know exactly how to fold it, yeah. which is nice. Width is obviously the same on most so <laughs> kind of side by sides, but um, yeah, it is really nice, obviously, the fact that it just folds so flat. It's very surprising how, fold, how flat it flat folds. It folds. Uh, Gemma Stanley, big basket, baguette friendly. We love yeah. the baguette. Uh, Debbie, I love keeping it simple. I think sometimes that is the way. Sometimes when you overcomplicate things, yeah. it, you can get more stressed, it doesn't work as well. Sometimes but simple can be better. Because as well, when you have got two children with you, it can be, obviously, it's not the easiest, especially if you're on your own. No, so you no. want to make things as uh, to make it as easy as possible. Absolutely. For yourself. But such a nice one, and I say great pricing as well. 140, you can't beat that. 140 pounds. So yeah, seats from birth to 15 kilograms on each side as well. And the reversible liners. They all come included. Yeah. Um, we only sell it in this colour, but the yeah, they, it's a nice one because it's, you don't have to have these in. No, you can take them out altogether if you don't want it. 
So you obviously you can just have your plain black push chair or you've got that bit of pop of colour which I quite like as well. Keely Marie says so slim, uh, that's so slim. It's it probably is. one of the slimmest ones I'll I think say. so far. Um, does it stand upright? Doesn't stand on its own? No, it's not freestanding, but you can kind of obviously store it and stand it up, so, lean it up something. Probably because it folds so flat, it has that niceness to slide in somewhere. Yeah. Or if you do need to lean it up against anything, it's which like is really, really nice. It's like a maze of push chairs in here this morning. I know, and everything's double width. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so there's no room for everything. So look at this for a pop of colour. <laughs> I love it. I love a bit of pop of colour in the morning, on a Monday morning, it's what you need, isn't it? Exactly. You see that, imagine walking down the street and it's a bit of a gloomy day and you see that, it might put a smile on your face, wouldn't it? It would indeed. It does for me anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Please it tell is, me if someone else nice. joins me. It is me. nice, it is. Um, but I think I'd go for maybe one of their, like either hedgerows or whatever. Kind yeah, of it's not, like, but for a bit of pop of colour, if oh, you yes. are looking for that sort of... Um, yeah, if that's the sort of thing you are liking. And I think it's just fun, isn't it? It's fun for that toddler age. Absolutely. If you are looking for a sort of simple mm -hmm. stroller. Mm -hmm. This one, um, so you have got... Um, uh, Ashley has said, are these the last two? Yes, we've just got the uh, Casato Bush Double and then the Mountain Buggy Duet. Yes, I'm sorry to, to kind of obviously... It's a long one, but we've got doubles. There's doubles it's everywhere. Um, but yeah, to take the seat down, just got your button. And push down, and obviously then, obviously if the child's in there, it will naturally. Fiona loves the colours. Fall down. See, you're with me. You're with me. Someone's got to be with her. At the back. Debbie says, "Wow, not sure about that." <laughs> Thank you, Debbie. <laughs> What's wrong with it? <laughs> really, really bright. Yeah, yeah. I like the fact they've added a multitude of different colours, different patterns, different sizes. They do sell this in different patterns, <laughs> just to let you know. But it's Sarah, not just this one. Zara has said, um, "Like that you have a proper colour in." Um, in the options today so yeah it's nice to have a bit of color see louisa said wouldn't miss that this in a hurry no you wouldn't no um you push chairs going really Josh, you Josh has said wow that's definitely not gray <laughs> no you can get more opposite of gray say, could you definitely got a different color it's wheel, basically right? a rainbow on a push chair it's great Zara said it's not gray woohoo uh jenny roberts loves i say that's the thing i think it, there is a lot of um, i mean i've got to be completely transparent here i am the most Bog boring. standard, boring <laughs> colour. I don't wear colour. I don't. I wore a pink jumper once. And everyone's like, oh my god, you've actually got a bit of colour on. I'm like, yeah. oh, I know, it's, <laughs> that's just not like me. Um, I like more of a classic kind of beige and taupe yes. colours. Yeah. But for a bit of fun for toddlers, I think it's great. Yeah, I bit think definitely, you, even though obviously they are from, from birth seats and themselves, yeah. you could look at this one maybe and they get a little bit older. So yeah. when they want a bit more fun, they yeah. want a bit more colour, it's really nice pop that does They do it also have nice. it in Fika Forest, which is their kind of most neutral tone um, and colours. Absolutely. It's grey and mustard, so yeah, it's a nice one to look at. Not one thing I colour. love, not just one snap pocket at the back, you no. have two. You have See? two snap pockets. So you can have one So when this snap girl. pocket is empty, you've got this one to fit onto. <laughs> That's for your M&M Krispies and my M&M Peanuts. Perfect. Yeah, if you don't like to mix and match your foods, you know, you can have them. That's it. Salt and vinegar crisps and ready salt in this Ooh, side. Oh, nice. Oh, no, actually, I don't know why I said that. Probably I love prawn salt and cocktail vinegar. and salt and vinegar. Oh, yeah, I like prawn cocktail. But um, what they actually designed for. <laughs> <laughs> um, you have got your little clips, so you can put your keys. You can attach your purse in there. If you are just out, it just means it's nice and secure to the push chair. Emily um, Newton says, I'm sure children prefer bright colours to the black and grey. Great for sensory. Absolutely. Because I also work with the Surrey Baby Sensory so uh, Lab. So they help develop, they help sort of like baby sensors themselves. Yeah. And everything's nice and bright to them, especially on the inside as well, which is lovely. Yeah. Um, but yeah, nice big seats. And I do like the fact you do get your bumper bars included. Um, you can take them off if you don't want them into place. Can, can I just interrupt for one minute? So uh, Liz uh, Charton has just noticed, have you got a pink wheel cap on your side at the rear? Yeah. There's a blue one on my side. So you have pink and blue on the wheel caps. There you go, Liz. You've spotted something we haven't Can spotted. I just also spot it out? The harness is different colours as well. So not only the harness straps, but the button. We are also... colour coding, guys. Colour coding. Colour coding. So... I like the fact that they've added a multitude of different colours. Mm -hmm. Two baguettes, Maya has said. <laughs> yeah, two baguettes will fit in there. Yeah, but it, it really would, it really would. Okay, um, Keely really said, easy. Keely said <laughs> um, too wacky for me. I thought that said too whiskey for me. I was like, is it five o'clock <laughs> somewhere? Too whiskey for me? <laughs> I'm a little bit confused. Where there. are you? But, I'll come join you. But wacky, wacky, she said. Not whiskey, it's wacky. Oh. <laughs> uh, we're making Ashley hungry. <laughs> yeah. Let us know, actually, what snacks are you fancy in it? What snacks would you put in your pocket? Oh, I'd have anything. 
Yeah, I like chocolate peanuts or even chocolate covered raisins. It's really. got to be something easy to. Do you know what I, me and Laura would put in there? Cashews. Oh, cashew God, nuts. you're on a cashew high at the moment. Cashew nuts, yeah, that's what will be in but there. But don't eat more than 15 if you're on Slimming World. <laughs> <laughs> Fun fact of the day. Fun fact of the day, no more than 15 if you're on Slimming World. <laughs> <laughs> the baskets on here, they are a good size, but they don't come up as quite as high as something like the Joy. So you may um, just be a bit more mindful of what you do put in there because it can obviously come back if you are kind of going up a curb or something. But still a great size to pop any little bits and bobs in as you're out and about. Mm -hmm. Your brake is really nice that it's on the... Um, right hand side of the back axle um, and it's typical Passato brake, flip flop, friendly. Friendly. flip flop friendly brake and it's so easy to do um, which I really like. Now the wheels on here are obviously a little bit smaller if you've had the Wush 2 you know they're yeah. kind of a bit smaller you do get um, I say four uh, of the wheels very much similar the same, similar same mm -hmm. size aren't they really yeah. um, but great for walks park walks things like that it's still yeah. Just as normal, like, you know, keep your wheels nice and tidy, lock them as well, just so yep. you can be a bit more sturdy ride going through. Um, two people have asked, I can't find you again, I do apologise, have asked, can you get it in like a boy, boy and a girl, girl? I don't think No, so they only do the bro and sisters kind of like a... That's their design. Yeah, um, but they do have it, the other ones are like Fika Forest. They have two other designs, I think, in this mm -hmm. one now. So you, if you have got two little boys or two little girls, probably yeah. go for one of the other colours, whereas obviously this one you can have a boy and a girl and you've got that option. Don't hold yeah. it just yet, that's the magic part. I'm teasing people, I'm teasing. <laughs> Um, on the hood, you do get a magnetic cover that just opens up the peekaboo window. Because obviously these seats are world facing, it just allows you to see your little one. And then, always stays nice and neat. And I like the extra coverage this hood gives, and you can kind of tuck it away when you don't need as much. So it's got multi use, multi purpose. Absolutely. I'm sort of losing a little bit where the conversation is going with this one. Whiskey. Um, so we've gone down to drink got, now. Uh, Lauren O'Connell, definitely not, definitely not my cup of tea. Oh, as the colour, I'm with you. I was thinking we're not putting drinks in the pockets. We're on about snacks. But yeah, I'm with you now. Colour, definitely not a cup of tea. No, yeah. I'm back in the room. Back in the room. She's back it. here. She knows what you're talking about. Uh, so exactly. Each seat will go from birth <laughs> to um, 15 kilograms. <laughs> She's having a good old giggle. Over Ashley it. said, "I just need, I just need M&Ms now. You've mentioned them and sent my husband out to get some." <laughs> Oh, what about that? You could drop us some off at the same Exactly. Time. Just sort of, don't put them for the little box. We won't open that for about a week. And they'll be like, oh, yeah. <laughs> there they are. Should we send that? You don't mind. You can go nips and get some M&Ms. Yeah. Well, uh, food warehouse. Yeah, I'll work out where one is. Yeah. We can do that. Can yeah, do she's, it. Not, she's not from around here, are you? No. <laughs> um, but yeah, each seat goes from birth to 15 kilograms. And you have got that more of a separation between each seat as well. And then the fold. Um, if you know Casato again, their folds are really easy and simple. Oh, I forgot. Oh, Georgia's favourite. I'm coming! <laughs> you won't miss that, will you? So, if they don't see the colour first, they will hear you yeah. first. <laughs> I would love this pushchair, just for that very reason. You can obviously buy bells and just put them on your pushchair. Absolutely. They're all eating now. Sounds like an old phone. What's going on? Right standard point? ring ring, like home ring, phone. Ring, ring! Yeah. That one. Um, but yeah, you fold on this one, you've just got a safety catch, slide button, and then your twist bar. So slide, twist, and then it will just kind of constantine down. Now and look how good that catch. is. Um, Alina has said, do you need inserts to use it from birth? No, you don't. No, the you can just use it straight fine. as it is. I love the fold of this push chair. Mm -hmm. Absolutely love it. Joanne has said, OMG, a bell. Yeah, sorry, <laughs> I did think about that. They actually had to listen to that. Um, Sean, I think it is, is it can you take the bell off? <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, you can, can actually, yeah, with yeah. a little screw, but <laughs> why would you want to? Gemma said it's very loud. Yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> We're just testing it works, you know. Testing you listening, you see. Exactly, sometimes we don't play with these push chairs in a while, I've got to check every noise works in them. Yeah. Um, so the Casato Wush 2 Double is from birth to 15 kilograms per seat, and that is a price of £299.95p. Yeah. So not too bad of a price for a really good product no. itself, I think. No, and I like the fact that, obviously, as you can see here, I've got it in a freestanding position. They've designed the back of the seats here. <laughs> so this is all waterproof. Um, it has got a waterproof covering there. Um, and the reason for that is, obviously, that's what's touching the floor. So there you go, freestanding double push chair as well. And it's, it's got the little feature on there um, to keep it nice and clean. You're you gonna have love this. got... Emily, yes, get me that bell out of my way. Ha 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 ha. 
See? She doesn't I know. was wondering what I said on it. It says ring my bell. I thought it was going to say ring with caution. <laughs> See, I'm on about whiskey and you're about ringing with caution. Yeah. How good was that to get up? I love getting the wash up and down. She loves getting it up. Nice it's literally like a magic trick. Upright standing is good. It's very good, especially obviously depending on room in the house or even room in the boot. So it's definitely a very, very good push chair yes. as one. Would you like me to show the mountain buggy? Yes. We got it. Um, Oh, cameraman, you've been great today with your close-ups. There you go, He's cameraman. a good cameraman, bless him. We, when he looks in the studio, he's like, there's a lot to do. Yeah. <laughs> he's like, don't worry, we'll do like, what, an hour and a half tops. No, yeah, an hour and a half, yeah. <laughs> so this is your mountain buggy duet push chair. So again, would you say very similar to you out and about? <laughs> See, I laugh and I'm like, can I Pauline, say? Pauline, space it. someone's put, what on earth do you need a bell for? And then they put, to announce our arrival. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's like, we're here, guys. guys. That's what I do. gets trumpets, we get a bell. See? Nice uh, and easy. <laughs> someone's put, no one wants a bell. Emily's put, speak for yourself. I'd love a bell. <laughs> <laughs> now, now, let's all play fair. <laughs> So your mountain buggy duet push chair itself, maybe very, very similar to Out and About. Uh, this time it's a little bit more, more bigger in the style of it. You do get, obviously, it's a four-wheel push chair this time. Um, your seats are from birth and can go up to 18 kilograms of weight. <laughs> so again, you're looking at roughly your three and a half, four years itself. You can have a carry cot on here as well, so you do have that option again. If you wanted newborn face new from birth to six months, they can do. And again, you can have two carry cots on this one. Yeah. We know this one. Um, so again, you can have for the first six months them still facing you. Then after six months, you can have them um, world facing. Or if you went for the carry cot plus, um, you can have that option, which is obviously mainly for like your doubles if need uh, for twins. You can still have that facing you. Um, but then have them parent facing as well, which is quite a nice little feature. Um, Claire has said, not too sure on this one. Which one is it you're not sure on? Is it the Casato for the pattern or is it this mountain buggy that we're looking at? It's got a bit like your, your grid colour. I it has got cool. different uh, colours. So if you're familiar with mountain buggy, they have the luxury range. Mm -hmm, absolutely. And then you've got your standard colours. But your seat liners are reversible, so you can have them black. So it's just the hoods that are patterned or you mm -hmm. can have the seats that are black. Um, which is great, and that's a really thick seat liner, which I love. Gives you the option, which is nice. Yeah. You get a oh. cup hold. You right? Yeah, I've left the seat on. Oh. <laughs> um, you get nice little accessory parts. Obviously, you can get a cup holder, which can attach, and you do get a bottle holder as well, which is nice and handy. So obviously, mountain buggy mainly dera uh, deranged. <laughs> mainly designed. <laughs> if you are going mainly a deranged, bit, for sure. If you are going off roading a little bit more. You do get your airfield tyres. Now, these do go up to a uh, PSI, I think it is, from 20 to 22 PSI on your wheels itself for the yeah. inflation. Manly inflated, uh, but they're not too difficult to do, which is really, really handy. Josh, Josh, he's not a fan of the uh, pattern. She, he said it looks a bit old school. Yeah, a bit like a, a gingham kind of. For me like, personally, of it would just it just sends my eyes a bit funny. Yes. It's one of those sort of designs. It's Maybe a bit of a, what's it called, elliptical? What is it? Optical illusion. Optical illusion. That's almost a bit like that. It makes me eyes like see it and then don't see it kind of style. Um, but I do like the luxury heron bow design that they do in this. Yes. Yes. A bit more, a bit more grey, but with a bit more of a tone to it as well, which is quite nice. And it was say Claire said that she um, she doesn't like it. It's the grid design. Say so it's design. not for everybody. No, the design. Not. But it does come in lots of different colours as well, mm -hmm. which is great. You obviously can see your seat ups and to lay them down as well. You just sort of want to pull out your clips. And again, with weight inside, you can eat. It looks like a go-kart from the bottom of the frame. It does, to be fair, in the pit. Oh, well, the back where, You can see where you're looking <laughs> from. It does look a bit like a go-kart. But then again, it's nice and easy to sit up with as well. Nice size basket. And what I really like with the basket, you get two little separate pockets as well. So again, if you want to put a little parts, you need to get to quite quickly. Or if you do just go out with your phone or your keys, they're there, accessible as well. Yeah. Um, you can obviously buy accessories. You can get hand mittens as well, which can attach to your handlebar. So I know we're coming out of the winter season, but you can always buy accessories for the push chair. And who doesn't like an accessory, Georgia? Oh, well, we love an accessory We love here. an accessory. You love your bell, I like my muffs. All good. Yeah. <laughs> you have got a foot brake at the very, very bottom, and it's just a kick down to engage it straight away. So nice and easy. It's not a flip-flop friendly one, unfortunately. So you do have to kick it up to reconnect easy, it easy back. Easy to do though, isn't it? But well, you do get a handbrake as well. So she's not a running push chair. But you can just, if you are standing in uh, one place for a long period of time, you can just engage your handbrake. And again, that puts the main brake on itself. Yep. As soon as you let go, you have your motion back. Oh, people are loving the basket, loving Which the pockets. Nice. 
you can change the height of the handle just with your pivot, so more of a pivot than a telescopic, but still nice and easy and a good height adjustment. I like, it sounds really strange, but I like the feel of the handle on that one. Yeah, it's because it's got like a covering over it, which is quite nice. Mm -hmm. And I think because obviously it's not got the foam, you're not going to pick it. I'm a picker. So if there's a bit of foam that's up, I just constantly... Yeah. But yeah, because it's nice and protected, you're not going to get that, which is really, really nice. Your front wheels you can lock, and it is just the buttons on the very, very front. Nice push down just to align, and then they lock straight away. So again, if you do go a bit rough terrain of all the push chairs, lock your main front wheels, and you'll go through the straighter options and you're going to use your rear wheels as like a BMW car as your rear wheel drive. Yeah. Nice and simple and easy. I thought you were going to say something there. Um, I was. Um, I forgot my name. I think it was Ashley. I think she said, can you take the wheels off? You can take the yeah. wheels off nice and easy. They are quick release. So mm -hmm. easy if, obviously, if you need to take the width off. Although, to be honest, the wheels sit within the frame. So I wouldn't I imagine. I say, she's not, not too bad a fold. No. So speaking of fold, you have here just underneath so it's on your right hand side you've got a little button here and your main section this part i'm just going to stand the other way so it's easier for me sean's put i don't like the bell <laughs> <laughs> we're over the bell now so pressing the button rev and then you're bending down together yeah you can make that handle a little bit smaller if it's a bit of a longer fold but it mm -hmm. is fairly flat Absolutely. When the, um, I think you've got your wheels in the lock position, haven't you? Uh, no, I unlocked them. Oh, no, you haven't, yeah. I think we're okay. So it's probably a little bit more of a, a bulky fold, not as flat as some of the other ones. Yeah. Um, but again, sometimes with double push chairs, depending where you're using or, you know, what kind of styles, you might always keep it upright if needed. Yeah. And when you did put it in the car, you just might know it's only going to take that in there. You won't be able to do like your main big Tesco shop itself no. so but no it's not not too bad a fold and it's easy to get it back up again flick straight back out again oh i've got some lovely comments nice and easy nice and simple so i was put this last hour has gone so quickly thanks for helping me pass the time oh you're welcome let us know because say zara that's um been induced oh right yes i think i forgot that right yes yeah, been induced today so let us know how you get on zara Absolutely. fingers crossed hopefully you won't have to wait too long no but no, I quite like the mountain buggy one. It's not um, too bad. Actually, that's the ventilation on the hood. There's not. There's just your peekaboo windows at the very top itself. Yeah. Now, there's not actual ventilation, but the hoods, naturally, when they join, they don't sort of stick at the back. So when it is fully out, they can have a little bit of a flexibility as well. Yeah. So a little bit of air will go through there, but there is no actual ventilation yeah. connecting points. And Katie itself. said, you girls have... Li legit made lockdown so much more bearable 16 weeks pregnant and tuning in every day oh lovely thank you very nice let us know um in the comments which one's your favorite now we've been through them all mm -hmm. is there one that you really like is there a feature on one that you really like absolutely absolutely one you prefer to the other certain colors different styles so <laughs> yeah Gemma, love your weekday lives ladies thank you and thanks cameraman they we couldn't do it without you. No, we You're couldn't. right, we couldn't no. do it without Jose <laughs> and the cameraman. So no, we couldn't. No, Jose is the cameraman. He went Jose I, and the I went Jose <laughs> the cameraman. <laughs> Jose the cameraman. <laughs> do we have, you don't have two. No, it's just the one, just the one. No, just the one. So no, really nice push You do get your nice little visor over the front. Well, it has got your ventilation over there as well. Um, so baby is nice and covered. You get a nice five point harness as standard. Your bumper bar, you can undo. Oop if you do need to and you can swing it out of the way to get the children in or because it's not too close you can easily slide in or they can climb in or remove it all together yeah so yes but yeah all it was zara that's it being juiced was it zara i was gonna say you sort of i will do thanks guys so okay. yeah good luck zara <laughs> if um, not surprise you might be going into it <laughs> we have lots of other videos if you wanted to look back and Keep you entertained. Absolutely, absolutely. Is there any other things that you want to see? But also, is there any recommendations? Is there any things that you haven't got for the twins yet that you want in maybe a twin mm -hmm. um, live? Yep, could do when that. When they're yes. here? Lots of different options. Oh, Louise said you definitely brighten up a morning. Aww. Oh, thanks. Which one, me or Kirsty? Me. <laughs> maybe it's both of us. Or the cameraman. Maybe the cameraman exactly. brightens up their morning. No one ever sees the cameraman. They just know how good he is with his actions. <laughs> <laughs> um... Liz, look of the donkey, but got to be the joy. 
Yeah. I think that's probably a favourite. Megan's definitely the donkey. Mm -hmm. Gemma's the donkey. Alina, the donkey in the mountain buggy. Donkey, yeah. donkey. Oh, the donkey's getting a lot of love. Like, the donkey's getting some love today. It's sort of weird because obviously we bought the donkey on and it's main. It's the main push chair, if that makes sense. Mm -hmm. so a lot of these, obviously, our classes are, are double strollers. Yeah. Um, but definitely the strollers are, do compete quite well with the donkey, you know, mm. especially given that option of having yeah. obviously a carry cot on there from the birth six months. You can obviously take it off the seats mm -hmm. when you go from birth. Um, yeah. They fold nice and flat without having to take the seats off. Um, I think if I didn't have the donkey, I think it would be the Baby Jogger City Mini 2 GT2, mm -hmm. whichever way it was. Oh, Steph said she would love a twin live, due twins in June. Ah, there you go. Perfect, Let we'll add that to know. the list. Zara said she loves the Bugaboo Donkey for the travel system, the mm -hmm. out and about for the practical practicality for grandparents and the Cosato for the colour. Ah, oh, there you go. Three in one jobby. Yes. Joanne, steady cameraman. Camera see, work. See, very good work. He's holding his stick, bless him. Keeps it nice and sturdy. Yes, it, it, it'd be a lot better than if we was to do it, let's be honest. It would be all over the shop. <laughs> um, Gemma would love to win the pregnancy prize today. Yes, so today um, we are giving away, oh, I said pregnancy prize, we're not giving away pregnancy. <laughs> well, we could send that through the post, but I wouldn't know how well it would turn up. <laughs> I can't hold that one. Um, but the pregnancy pillow is what we are giving away. That we can send through the post. <laughs> oh gosh. Um, so it's a pregnancy and nursing pillow. And it's by BB Hug Me. Um, it's a really nice design on there. And it's worth up to £130. And we will be announcing the winner very shortly. Um, and what we do is kind of scroll through all the comments. One of us says stop. And that's the winner. We choose the winner that, that day. So, nice well, about easy, five nice minutes. And simple. So, yeah, really nice. Uh, Louise says, think the donkey is the most modern and stylish looking. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Gives you that option of majority of, of styles, which is quite nice. We have got some fingers crossed. Get mm -hmm. sharing, put in the likes, comments, get your last comments in because we'll, we'll be joining very, very shortly. Absolutely. And um, I'll just sort of run through the prices again, just if you are interested and did miss it. So for your Bugaboo Donkey, you can have it in mono, duo or twin. So mono for one child is 1,095 pence. Uh, so 95 pounds and then your duo um, you can have it obviously um, for so you get one um, so you get one lot of seat carry cot material and two <laughs> lots of seat unit material oh my goodness let me say start that again so duo one lot of carry cot material two lots of seat unit material so one seat can only ever have the seat unit on but the other one can have carry cot and seat um, and that's 1,335 in twin mode, um, so two of everything is 1450 Not too bad, not too bad. Prices may vary if you choose a different frame and so on. Mm -hmm. You're out and about um, Nipper Double V4. It's currently on offer for £429. Yeah. Should be 599 So really good price on offer there. Absolutely. Good product, good product. Nice extra pockets, which is really, really nice. Yeah. Um, next is the Baby Jogger City Mini 2 Double, and that's currently £519. Mm -hmm. And then um, it's kind of like, I'd say older sister, newer sister? I don't know. Maybe newer sister, should we say. Yeah. Um, Baby Jogger City Mini GT2 Double um, is £535.20, currently on offer, but should be 669 Very good promotion price. Definitely. Um, I've got. Um, here, your mounted buggy duet V3, um, it's from £595 to £649, so depending if you want in the luxury and, um, and so on. Um, and then I've got here the Joy Air, this is the twin stroller and it's £140 for your Joy Air, which Very is good. really great. Still get UV protection hoods, which is really nice, from birth to 15kg, so can't, yeah. can't be a good reasonable double push yet. No, and then lastly we have got a Cosato Wush 2 double, um, and that is 299 and 95 pence, and it's a great pop of colour, mm -hmm. but they do have different ones and as well. And it comes with a bell. And it comes with, Wait I'm really sorry it. everyone, just once. There we go. <laughs> you got to make a girl happy, you got to make a girl happy, eh? <laughs> so... I'll put the prize in the middle. So whoever the lucky winner is today, it will be popped on the van and, and be with you tomorrow. So yeah. Quick and easy. Really quick. Do you want to? I'll say stop. <laughs> she doesn't like the pressure. She doesn't like the pressure. Because no, if I mess it up, I'll get moaned up. 
Louise put, yes, twins are pricey. They yeah, are. Indeed. Um, my, I'm using six cushions to get comfortable at the minute. Definitely need a pregnancy pillow. Oh, oh bless. bless, fingers yeah. crossed. And um, we, if not, I say we do stock a lot of different pregnancy pillows mm -hmm. for mamas and papas. Yeah, pure um, flow. Um, TPO flow ones as well. So we do have different options and they are on our website if you are needing one. Absolutely. Say next day delivery, so it can be with you, so you can have that good night's sleep. So yeah. in stock, next day delivery. Yeah. Um, da, 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 da. Just see if I'm missing anything while I was doing the prices. People just loving the, the, the pillow because they say they are struggling at night. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> quite a few say, gosh, twins are expensive. They are indeed. Oh, sorry, it's a slow process, so glad I got to watch this live. Oh, I'm oh, pleased. There you go. But yeah, let us know, Zara. So, what I'm going to do mm -hmm. is I'm going to scroll, and then Kirsty's going to say stop, and we'll stop, and whoever I stop on will be the winner. Very nice. I don't like looking, it's the pressure of not, not looking. Okay. So, I'm going up and down. Stop. So, I have stopped on um, Liz Charlton. She's put, Are the seats newborn friendly? Yes, they are. <laughs> yeah. So I'm just going to... Congratulations, Liz. Reply, congratulations. So just put a note on there just so we can then find you. But if you could send us through a private message on Facebook, your uh, name, address, contact telephone number and email, and we'll get that on the courier today, and you'll receive it tomorrow with an hour window from DPD. Yeah. So yeah, thank you everybody for joining um, this morning. So hopefully you found it helpful because it is quite a lot to look at mm -hmm. and there's quite a lot of double side by sides, Absolutely. isn't there? Lots of different options that maybe people don't think about. <laughs> Louise, did you say winner, winner, chicken dinner? No. Oh, so the Kirsty would say, that's why I'm questioning it. <laughs> Louise has put winner, winner, chicken dinner and I'm See, like, I can't work out she said it. <laughs> I, know, I kept saying whiskey and candy. <laughs> yes, you do. So, yeah, the um, I think there might be some sort of delay. Some sort of, have we announced the winner? We have just announced the winner, mm -hmm. and it will be uh, sent out to Liz Charlton. So, well done. Absolutely. Well done, Liz. Well done, Liz. Uh, but, yes, thank you, everybody, for joining. Um, we will be going live, like always, Monday to Friday mm -hmm. um, around 11 o'clock. Um, it's really nice, obviously, to see a lot of the similar faces uh, around. A lot of similar names. <laughs> Not name faces, don't know why I said faces. <laughs> Just because I normally would say faces when you can see people, <laughs> but names. Um, but yeah, um, if you are interested in looking at different products, if there is any recommendations you have got, mm -hmm. just let us know. Um, but we will be back tomorrow at 11 o'clock, so join in um, and there'll be another prize, won't there? Absolutely indeed. Have a lovely Monday, everybody. Thank you for joining. Bye. Bye-bye.